Hey, what is going on? CC Cam here, and you guys are winners, and welcome back to the Jingle Jam playthroughs. So today we're going to be playing Defend Your Life, which is a free mobile game that is like four quid on Steam, uh, and inexplicably in four by three aspect ratio for some reason, despite being a mobile game. So let's hop into it. Haven't played this at all. It seems to be a game where you basically it's a tower defense game based around defending your body from germs so we're going into the mouth expecting on easy don't think we play yep can't play medium gonna get some reward expect normal waves and let's go so got no idea it's probably gonna be a tutorial yeah welcome seems our body needs your help stop the enemy is crossing through the organs Build your towers. Look for the green arrow if you are not sure about the right place. What's this thing? Okay, I think we can buy two of those. So if I drop one there, one there, and then we go. So 20, got 20 health, 20 things can get through. Already got a cannon just here, which is nice. And obviously this is coming through to the mouth. So in a few seconds we're going to get another one. I think the game is too slow. You can change the speed using the button on the upper part of the screen. That one. Let's go. Okay, so we can go up to four times speed. Always useful. Tap on the bomb and drag it to the desired place. Look for the enemy groups. Bomb. Bomb. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have a problem here. Recharges. Recharges quite quickly. Boom. Cold. Unit with low number of hit points but strong attack. Very fast movement speed. A strong attack, so it can attack. It does more damage, I suppose. Hmm. Let's get in a defensive mechanism here. That could help. Are they sort of nails? Like Bloons Tower defense nails? Yes, they stop them. They slow them down. That's cool. Right, first win. Achievement get. You can't see it because it's in the bottom wrong. It's in the wrong corner on this one. Uh, I'm here because usually the achievements are over there. Always get the side wrong. Yeah, we got some money. Let's carry on. It's not a bad game. It's not particularly a bad game. Tablets can be spent in order to buy various upgrades. Visit the upgrade section and try some. Upgrade. Oh, that's that's not gold. Take your time and check all the upgrades. Tap on the icon for more information about the desired upgrade. You can sell and buy upgrades anytime. Let's try it with a bomb, for example. Bomb. Buy. Done. Let's carry on to the next one. So, you can finish the difficulty and then you can go back and do it on medium for more reward, which is pretty cool. Let's just carry on on normal. Don't have to really bother with anything. Quite good loading times. You kind of expect that from a mobile game. You can upgrade every building in the game. More upgrades mean more damage and additional options. So, upgrade for a hundo. Great! Platelets can slow enemies, but do not leave them alone in the battle. Support them with shooting towers. We upgrade this. Ooh. Shoots fast but not very effective. Let's do that one. Oh, it's a stormtrooper now. He's going to miss. Oh, we can zoom in. Ooh. Very nice. Let's put down. Hold on, what's this? Is it? Is it something that gives me more money? Because it seems to be pushing the germs through quicker. Which isn't a good thing. Right, let's go. Right, we'll drop an upgrade on that in a bit. We'll drop the other upgrade. So we had the quick shooting tower just there. Then when we get enough money, which is 110, we shall get the other one. See how that looks and plays. And just in case we are a bomb, I think the bombs are free. As far as I can tell so far, the bombs seem to be free. 
but it's just a recharge time. Which is quite a cool mechanic. I think these guys reload up. They don't really need any extra help, do they? And that fast movement speed on this cold guy, he's getting beaten by some worms. So he's just got low health. Use the next power, electric shock. It causes damage to all enemies on the map. They got more health. Oh, we can upgrade now. Tesla. So if you click on it, you can see the range just here. The range where they drop. Can't put them anywhere. You've got to put them on specific spots, which is a bit annoying. But meh. It's not too bad. I guess this one's... Yeah, this one attacks every five seconds. But does a lot of damage. This one attacks every quarter of a second and doesn't do as much. So it's 0 0.65. This one does 10 damage. So that's pretty much an insta-kill every 5.1 seconds. Uh, let's get some platelet and barracks out. Because these have been really good. How much to upgrade? The foot thing. Oh, you can move them? Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh dear. Can we get... Let's get one of them out. Let's get a cannon, because this guy's getting past. Uh... I'll get a platelet barret when I can. There we go. Let's get the platelet barret. Dangerous unit with the ability to divide into two other enemies after it dies. So it's slow, got a lot of attack, and 40 health. So that's going to be our backup. That's the usual we place them at the end. That's our backup. We've still got a few at the back, though, to deal with. So not enough money to do anything right now. Oh, that's an upgrade at 100. So, this game seems pretty good. Got a wave counter up here. 6 out of 18. Haven't lost any health yet. This is easy mode, so whatever. The barret's going to pick up. Don't know. Ah, yes. Dropped another one just there. With the baton. Seem to be getting one. I'm not sure where that one came from. Don't remember placing it. I remember placing that one, but not that one. Hmm. Medic! 100. Uh, oh, achievement progress. Medic. 100 out of 1,000. I guess that's produced 1,000 of these dudes. Interesting. Oh, we can upgrade. Let's up. Actually, can we upgrade this? 140 but locked. Okay, let's upgrade that one, and this one's locked as well. So nothing's going to get past our first row. Not a chance. Not a chance in hell. Lots of waves, though. It takes a while to get through these seams. Seems at some point you can just sort of sit with your arms crossed and have a nap. Because you can set up quite easily. This is easy mode, so I suppose if you wanted more of a challenge, you could get everything else. Well, that's got some good health. I think that probably, the quick-firing cannon probably does more DPS than the a lot of damage, especially if it comes in right at the end. It can only fire once, and it all, I think it always goes for something with the least health. I can't remember, there was a rule on this one that said it always went for something with the most health. You can see. Always attacks with the lowest, always attacks with the highest, right, so it doesn't go for the... If it went for the lowest, it would, of course, be useless. Going for something with one health left by everything else. Uh, can't grade anything. Let's do the cannon, because it's got a bit more range, I think. Put another barracks down. Barracks seem to be... One of the best upgrades you can get, I think. Even if they are getting knocked out quite easily. Oh, this guy's not actually attacking the flu, he's just stopping it. Huh. Well, that's interesting. Hmm. Yeah, they're just sort of slowing the... 
slowing the push down, so I guess we've got to upgrade for 100 to get them to do attacking. Which means we probably need a cannon down here, just in case. We are getting through the raves before the next wave comes through, so that's pretty good. We'll upgrade that. Oh, and they instantly upgrade, even if they're coming out now. That's quite nice. It's quite a nice thing to have. Oh, that's a generator. Right, so that gives you 10 bubbles every 10 seconds. So that's your passive income. And then you'll get more for killing these guys. Oh, you can say target this one. So if there's a huge one that you really want targeted, you can say to target that one specifically. That's quite cool. It's a good mechanic to have. What are these dudes? No idea. This cannon got better all use. To be honest, with this game, I think you're probably going to want to pick it up for free on mobile. I don't think it's particularly worth picking up on the PC for the asking price. But if you got it in the bundle, have at you, I suppose. Have fun. Get one just there to take out anything that's got past. Oh, he does bugger all damage, doesn't he? Oh dear. I'm gonna need another one. So that one's quite a good position. Because anything that gets past gets blocked by that. There's no more upgrades to give anything until down here. There's not really much more places to put stuff. Or just pad out everything with cannons because they're the cheap option you can get platelet barracks they don't attack though they're just blockades when you get them to the second level and they get some attack that's when they become very useful uh, but I'll put that in there and the barracks can continue so upgrade that cannon just there and it looks like we're almost done on this level. Almost done. It's going pretty well though. I think we've got enough guys out here to deal with basically anything. They're all down to half health by the time they actually get pushed through. Uh, even these guys. But that's what you've got. I'll wait for these to be able to be upgraded to the cannons. I don't like the Tesla coil thing. It's not that good. I guess we've got to buy stuff to upgrade these. And block ourselves from dying. Off to the lungs next, though. The next level would be the lungs. Let's upgrade a cannon. And we'll buy another cannon in a second. Wait, does it do more? Yeah. This is a really good upgrade. It does more damage. And less fire time. About half as much fire time, about twice as much damage. So that's pretty damn good upgrade. Plus these guys stopping people from coming round. And you're going well, you're going really well. Even just these cheap ones. That's how much do these cost? 80. If you can put one down to stop them, to let you get these guys, you could easily do it. Possibly even getting three of these cheapest ones in an area and one blocker would be the best option. But of course getting come on, huge upgrades. Big upgrades and they've got no chance. Coming up to the last wave though. Coming up. Let's speed it up. I forgot you could speed it. Speed. Speed and power and all that. Let's drop a 50 bomb there. Oh dear. This isn't going well. There's still two of those. Hopefully we'll have enough money. Oh, come on, please. Don't go. Come on. Come on, no. And there we go. Victory! With zero damage taken. Awesome. So actually that was a uh, that was a pretty fun game. Animations are quite nice. The uh, the gameplay is all right. 
But again, unless you got it in the bundle, I wouldn't put the... Uh, don't think it's really worth the three quid so far. But it's pretty good. Um, go pick it up, I guess. But do definitely donate to the bundle if you are watching this before the 31st of December 2017. It is on screen in the end card. So, yeah, go donate to that and give to charity. Have a nice day, and I'll see you next game.